Hey guys, I am Sid. That's it. We have a lot of boxes to unbox today, so let's get straight to what? You wanna see my face? Fine, fine. Here we go. So if you're oblivious like I was a few months ago, they are actually life-size, movie accurate, almost, Toy Story toys available for sale. Include certificate of authenticity, the Toy Story collection from Thinkway Toys. I couldn't really find any locally and I had to buy most of them from eBay and shipping was a... Anyway, let's start off strong with Woody. Full disclosure, this will not be a typical unboxing because I want to do their own individual ones where I go in depth and talk about what I want to fix for them. Because this is not accurate. For example, his mouth should be closed, buttons are wrong, bed should be textured, palms open instead of closed, the ring is too big and it is not slow retracting. And I can do this all day and it will take like 20 hours to make this video, so let's not do that. In fact, I've already made my own screen accurate Woody hate and I'll be going through how I did this in future videos. So let's take a look at what we have in other videos. It's vast like the oh my god, this is so heavy. I mean, I've seen so many reviews and I thought I knew what to expect, but damn, this this is substantial. How to open it? Oh, damn. I am Buzz Lightyear, Space Ranger. Wow. So cool. But yeah, first impression, the sound is so awesome. His head moves. And I know of some of his issues, like the shoulders being too rigid, his wrists are not ball jointed, and the design of this box is not accurate. Yeah, I'm that anal. There's a lot to fix. Next, we have Jessie. Two of them. I got this because I really like the pattern on this Jessie, and her outfit is not glossy. And I opted for the cloth leggings because I don't want this to happen. I only got this version for her hat and maybe some accessories that might be more accurate. But yeah, everything is pretty fine. Ooh. Next we have Bo Peep. Two of them. Actually three of them. There's still one on the way, but this is the Toy Story 4 Bo Peep. I want to use this face because it's more accurate to a toy mode face. I will repaint it and do a head swap with this version that has an actual outfit. This outfit is probably the most detailed one you can get out there. Look at the details, she even has a cape. The only issue would be the fake bandage and the purple tape, which I will replace in the future. Who's next? Come on, okay. Open the other one first. Okay, now we have Barbie and Ken. But let's take a look at Barbie first. This is the Toy Story 3 Barbie, and we have the Toy Story 4 one as well, right here. And this is inspired by David from Today I Grew Up. Uh, basically, it's a, it's a face swap. Basically, it's a head swap and a clothing swap to make it more accurate. But I think I would want to do a repaint to make it more accurate. But I want to take it to the next level and do a repaint on the head sculpt. Let's take a look at Ken. Ah, this is a Hawaiian vacation Ken doll, but without the clothing. It's okay because I only need the head sculpt and the body because I bought the vintage animal, animals, animal loving Ken. Animal loving Ken? Animal loving Ken, yep. Because he has the most accurate outfit. And yes, I will be doing a repaint as well. Ah, damn it. Okay, it's not all bad. Let's look at some things that we do not need to modify. And we have here the aliens. Actually, we do need to modify. We need to add some squeakers to it. But that's it. And now we have the Mighty 3. Why do I call them that? Because they are the most expensive out of the Wave 3. We have Dolly, Buttercup, and Mr. Pickle Pants. But these are knockoffs. 
some people feel very strongly about this but I think they look pretty darn legit so I'm happy with this. I'll be making a video on this and some other knockoffs that I've found in China and maybe do a little comparison. Okay, since we are on the topic of soft toys, let's bring them all out. We have lots of... Stand up, stand up. Not so can't stand. Bunny, 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 bunny. Oh my god, my table is so small. Ducky! Oh, Ducky is ugly. But look, Bunny is so cute. Oh, he's so fluffy. So far. Okay, I don't know how to modify soft toys, but I would definitely want to touch on. Nope. I would definitely want to customize lot so because it's not accurate at all. Where can I put them? Where can I put them? Okay, unfortunately my table is just too small, so I need to clear some space for the next unboxing. Moving on. Oh my god, this is huge. <gasps> I mean seriously, I'm I'm from the one six scale world, and I thought those are big, but this is this is crazy. Huh? Okay, this one I know because it's the only one from Japan. It was described to have a battery leakage and it's not working, so I hope that I can. Oh my, what the? F I haven't been scammed. Oh. Apparently this this is a gift. And I, I, I legit thought that I got scammed because this is the first thing I saw. Wow, it's so huge. How did Andy even play with this? It's already bulky for me and I am huge. There are some blemishes here and there because it's like at least 10 years old. And yep, that is the leakage. I don't know if I can fix it, but I will try. So Slinky, you have already seen. And I don't think there's a lot of things to fix about this. Maybe the leather years and yeah I can improve the articulation somehow this is an exciting one do you know the lighting mod yeah I want to try it and I discussed with my dad and he said he can do it so I'll try to get it done and film it for you guys. Oh, you've already defeated you. Oh no, this guy has seen better days, man. Damn, look at this. <laughs> the elusive utility belt bust like here. And I thought, wouldn't it be a good idea to try and fix it up? You know, for content? But this looks like a big project, man. Let's test if it even works. Initiating full perimeter sensor scan of sector 1. Not bad. What's that noise? It sounds like adventure! <laughs> I don't even know if I could succeed, but it's better than the usual 3D scout pre-print routine that I've been doing. So I'm still quite excited to try and fix this. Last but not... <laughs> Gabby, Gabby. Oh my... God, oh, that's the, oh, the smell. Oh, I mean, I've watched reviews about this and I thought I knew what to expect, but oh my God. Oh, 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 oh fuck on the vomit. <laughs> it's not too bad. I wish she had real eyes and a voice box. I will definitely try to mod her and Benson. Maybe, maybe not. It's too creepy. Anyway, that's all I have for you. I hope you guys enjoy this unboxing as much as I have. Are you looking forward to the individual reviews or the mods that I'm going to attempt? What else am I missing? I'm a sculptor so I can try to make them from scratch. Leave a comment below and let me know. We will still be doing one set skill customs but we will slot in some Toy Story customs along the way. So I hope you stay tuned to my channel, subscribe and I will see you next time. Ah, oh, fuck man. And today's unboxing is sponsored by My Kidness.